now it's time for Adventure Time, the story of Paddy and Laurie, playing a game of Paddy's devising, featuring dwarfs and other such figures. Right, now I usually come so unprepared that you've asked me to prepare something. Don't even bring your own oxygen most times, <laughs> to provide your little tank. Well, like, you, you always cook me dinner, you always buy the jet, and like, I just I show you up. Right, you treat me right, but Give so, you a fresh pair of pants. I thought I'd make, I thought I'd make the effort. Um, and you so have come dressed this time. I've come dressed, impressed. I've got trousers, but I've written a choose your own adventure. You seem to have written it on greaseproof paper, Paddy. Yep. <laughs> I didn't say I was that bad. <laughs> In blood. On the tube. It's 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 relatively poor. But okay, right, for, okay. Wonderful. First off, yeah, okay, you have to alright, tell me who your cat okay. It, Hang on, what are you gonna just tell me who your character is? What if I go straight for a robot? You're like, nope, it's actually set in feudal Japan. No, okay, it's 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 set in a fantasy realm. Ah, uh, okay. Um I'm so, a unicorn. No, you have to be <laughs> all right, be choose something to, you can be like a like a dwarf or a or a or a, like I don't know, an elf. Um, kind of I'm gonna be a one legged gnome. No, it's too difficult for him to get about. <laughs> right, okay. Are you gonna be human, elf, or dwarf? <laughs> okay, um, I'll be an elf lady. An elf lady? Called Hefrulavli. 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 But for ease, we'll call her. Flu. 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 Maybe he has got a flu. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. So she's an elf lady. What are you? Are you like a magician? Are you a warrior? You... A conjurer! A, a stage a stage magician. A so stage... All, all my powers are based around like a top hat and a rabbit and sawing people in half. That's all I can do. And coin tricks. Okay, I've got to see how I can try and build this in. <laughs> and rec- all right, okay. I'm ready. Do I need to get into character? Hello, 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 hello. Uh, no, actually, you just have to really make decisions. <laughs> like, it's a choose your own adventure. All right, mate. assume back, left, right, backwards, kill the witch. All right, okay. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, all right. Let's assume you're level one. <laughs> it's opposed to level seven. <laughs> yeah, straight away. We're starting at the beginning of the adventure, although it can't, it goes straight in. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Like, like we have to assume quite a lot of backstory, which may not be explained. Big up our good and evil trolls. Yeah. Magic monkey You're saves the world. You're getting there. Okay, right. You are standing at the ruined bridge. Oh, fuck. What's happened to the bridge? Of Kalpesh. Oh, Kalpesh. You know what happened to the bridge. Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> of course. Is that all that shit? It was technically your fault. Magic monkey. As you watch, the remains of the tank fall into the ravine. <laughs> and so I was... Sploosh! I was in a rush. <laughs> a single tear comes to your eye. Do you cry? Or... Do you? <laughs> no. Suck it up. Okay, Flo wait, hang on. is a brave conjurer. I've got a page 11. <laughs> <laughs> you decide not to cry. <laughs> <laughs> the cold-hearted flu, <laughs> unaffected by the death of the thousands of innocents in the tank. Oh, fuck off. What do you mean a tank? It was a tank of people. They I were like a... I think mean, like a you know a Sherman Mark II. It was a cross between the two. They've been imprisoned there by the wizard Raj. Okay. Raj. 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 Johnny Quest. No, Raj, you've already killed Raj. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, you kind of ki- never mind. Anyway, <laughs> you're 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 very aware that you're going to have to find a different way across the ravine. <laughs> okay. Okay. What are my options? Well, okay. no. Uh, give, give, okay. Me, give me a minute. Okay. Sorry. Okay. What across the ravine? You come up to a crossroads. Yeah. Okay. One of the crossroads, one of the, no, one of the, one of Roads. your potential exits leads back towards the cursed city that Ooh, Raj, you know, shit. where Raj used to keep his council. Yeah. The other one leads down to the local tavern Aww. where the adventurers gather. Love. And the other one <laughs> is back to the bridge. <laughs> I'd advise not choosing <laughs> option three. <laughs> oh. So would you like to go to the tavern or to the cursed city? What about the bridge? If you go back to the bridge, <laughs> I might have to go back to page one and it might be a very similar <laughs> situation to before. before. I'm going to go to the cursed city because I reckon the tavern's a trap. Okay, sure you don't sure you don't want to go to the tavern? <laughs> there might there might be more story content at the tavern. All right, fine, let's go to the tavern. Yeah, you've chosen... <laughs> hang on. You've chosen to go to the tavern through entirely your own decision. <laughs> this is just you telling me a story. You isn't arrive it? at the tavern. It is closed. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking waste of time, wasn't it? Next to the tavern uh. 
is an identical tavern. <laughs> this one, however, is open. Oh, okay. Do you wish to, A, go into the open tavern, B, wait for the closed one to reopen, bracket, it is dusk, and that might not be for a while. <laughs> they may have the refurbishers in, we don't know. <laughs> or C, back to the bridge. <laughs> um, I'll go to the open one for ease. Okay, for ease, you have chosen... The open tavern. Yeah. Okay. Right, this is where I, I get to do characters now. Okay. okay. You open the door to the bustling tavern. <laughs> the door. Are you doing sounds? Yeah. The warmth of a hearth oh. <laughs> overpowers you. Sound of warmth. You feel weak. Oh. <laughs> you need a good sit down. I need a good sit down. Potentially a meal, which is lucky Maybe as you are at a tavern. <laughs> this is very badly written, I have to say. You take an empty seat at the tavern bar. From the tavern now, bar. From here on out, known as the bar. <laughs> you are sat next to a gnome uh, he, with uh, both legs. <laughs> and I'm a gnome, I love both He is legs. looking quite disgruntled and angry about something. He is muttering to himself. Next to him is a book of spells. Oh, book of spells. Oh. The man behind the counter is old. <laughs> okay. What do you wish to do? You could yeah, keep to yourself, boring option. <laughs> talk to the gnome? Yeah. Talk to the barman? Yeah. Leave the seat and go to a different seat? Yeah. Which may contain more characters. <laughs> or leave the tavern perhaps <laughs> to go back to the bridge. Who knows? Who could say? Um, I'm going to talk to the gnome. You're going to talk to the gnome? Yeah. Okay, all right, okay, hang on. Um, what you, you, have to, you have to do the conversation. Hello, gnome. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I am the gnome. <laughs> the only gnome in, what was, this, what was the area called? Campesh. <laughs> what was it? No, that was the bridge. The only, oh, Archeon. That's what I call it, Archeon. Arche I am the only gnome in Archeon. We are a dying breed. I am the only gnome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's your go. <laughs> Which is my go. It's a your own adventure. Yeah, I'm no, going to make shit up. I've got a conversation happens. It goes well, go here. It doesn't go here. So you, you've got okay, to improvise. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um... <coughs> Oh, I'm so, oh, I've got what's cancer. Wrong? Oh, you've got cancer. Would you like me to do a coin trick to ease your passing? Magic has no place here. Elf. <laughs> I gave up magic just now. Did you? Hence the book of spells that I am not touching. Do you need that book of spells? Oh, I guess not. I would be willing to trade it. What for? Do you have any... Remnants from the recent disaster at the Bridge of Kalpesh. I've got a, a head of a young man. That's not good enough. <laughs> Maybe you should have searched near oh, the bridge. There wasn't an option to search near the fucking bridge. If you'd gone back, it might have been different. <laughs> it's a magic bridge. Oh, I didn't know that either. OK. Nothing to trade. Pa! You're not getting nothing from me, bitch. How about... The gnome turns back. Wait, 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 gnomey. What about a bit of, you know, naughty time in the tavern? No. I could show you the elfy ways of pleasure. No. Please. No. Please. <laughs> Gno. <laughs> Gno. I'm getting on me Gnu. He is now refusing to speak to you. Oh, fuck him. You could, I mean, I'm just putting this out there, try and steal the book. Oh, can I distract him? Right. With a, ma a, a trick with the rings, you know, and he goes, oh, the one ring's on the You're going to try and distract... Dist yeah. OK, all right, OK. You are using your class power. This is very complicated. <laughs> OK. Oh, cheers, your adventure. Right, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Six. What does that mean? You do one of them tricks with, uh, with the rings. <laughs> oh, is the ring attached? Is it not attached? I don't know. <laughs> It goes really well. Oh, wonderful. The gnome's passion for magic is re -enlivened. Great word. Not strictly And he correct. picks up his book and says, 
I'm off to go and be a magician. Oh, fuck it. That's terrible. The gnome has left the tavern, probably to go to the bridge. Shh. Oh. Do you want to try and stop him? Yeah, go on. Fine. Okay. Hang on, it's just when you roll in and shoot your own adventure book. I'm going to have to end. <laughs> I'm going to have to improvise here. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this to happen. Oh. Um, you run after the gnome and tackle him. Do you tackle him? I tackle. I Look, love a tackle. Okay, Flu tackles the Good gnome. Good rugby. Ah, oh, the gnome is dead. <laughs> no one saw. <laughs> okay, I kick the body into a ditch. Okay, you hide the body. Okay, are you taking the book of spells? Yeah, obviously. Okay, are you going to search him? Yeah, why not? On the gnome... Like on top of the you gnome. Find, Not even like in his possession, just on like on gnome, top of him. On the gnome, you find a crinkled bit of parchment, mm. which is probably a letter, not going to lie, <laughs> four bronze coins, oh, bronze. which are not used in this area <laughs> of Archeon, <laughs> so are potentially useless. Potentially, though. And a wand with the inscription, I don't like the wand anymore, on, the, on it. <laughs> He's also wearing clothes. I wouldn't take them. You oh, are a lot taking taller. all of his stuff, and I'm going to um, arrange his clothes into an amusing position. Okay. Which may or may not reveal his bum. Okay, right, okay. Do you want to go back into the tavern? Have I have got all the stuff? Well, you've got all of his stuff. There's more stuff going on in the tavern. Yeah, but I've got the book. I feel like... All right, I'll go to the tavern. Yes. Okay, you go Please. back into the tavern. You you feel a lot happier. You are now you now have I've killed a gnome. <laughs> you now have a shit. small amount of money and a, a letter which you haven't yet read. Now give me a fucking chance. <laughs> and a book of spells which you have also not yet opened. Okay. Okay. Um, you sit back at the bar, feeling pleased with yourself and your order... recent murder. <laughs> you told me to do. You, you I choose have... your own adventure, you <laughs> dick. <laughs> I'm gonna okay. Too. The barman. <laughs> Good. Looks up. Good. Can I get you anything? Was it Jon Snow? No. <laughs> it's he might come into this later. <laughs> it's Adam Sleet. <laughs> it's Kit Harrington. <laughs> it's a, sorry. Um, do you want anything or what? Oh, good. Um, can I have a Bacardi Breezer, please? Note, the barman is a racist. Ooh. Oh! Um, I, I say, no, thank you. Oh, <laughs> fine. The conversation ends there. Dis- uh, dis- dis- dissolve that situation like only an elf could. Exactly. Well done. Diplomacy. Seamless. <laughs> didn't even have to get the cards out. I didn't even have to roll. Didn't have to... <laughs> With my my dice that for some reason I brought. <laughs> okay, are you going to uh, read any of the things that may continue uh, the tale? I'm going to read the magic book. You're going to read the spell book? Yeah. Not no, the... read the letter first. Read the letter first. I'd go with that. Okay. Thanks, thanks um, impartial narrator. <laughs> I'm not even here. <laughs> okay. The, no- the, <laughs> the letter appears to be addressed to the gnome. Oh, what's his name? Um, G- Gimli. <laughs> I'm sensing a very strong sense of copyright. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay. Dear Gimli, I am writing to you from the cursed city of <sighs> Kalpet. Raj, Raj. Raj. No, the wizard's called Raj. Raj. I should have written it down. The <laughs> cursed city near the tavern. Yes. There's been an accident at the bridge. <gasps> but don't worry, <laughs> it seems everything will be fine. Everyone has been put into a protective tank. Oh, As long as shit. nothing happens to the bridge, they will be okay. Please come quickly. Signed, Jeff. <laughs> okay? Okay. Okay. I just about kept up, yeah. You have an extreme, an extreme sense of guilt washes over to you. Oh. oh. But the book beckons. Come here. Come on, let Can me open the book? Yeah, I've got another little read. <laughs> inside inside like... the book of spells there are many things okay wonders from a lost age magic unheard of <laughs> good there is a spell for charming people yeah which you could have potentially used on the gnome were he not dead <laughs> hang on no what hang on what but I'd have to charm him to get the book presumably no no you could have got information out of him but that's now you know Oh, give a shit, he's dead. He's dead. It's not my fault he's dead. Like, I hadn't planned for this. All right. 
Sorry. Okay. Just then, the barman pipes up. Yeah. Is that the Book of Talmoon? Slap him and run away. No, that's, what's the options? The options are yes. Yeah. No. Yeah. Elf. <laughs> Which is where you, you say something in elf. I'm going to go elf. Remember, he is a racist. <laughs> I'm going to go elf. I'm an elf here. Oh, sorry. That's not elf. <laughs> Galadriel? Try harder. It's all... That sounds like elf cunt to me, <laughs> says the barman. Get out of my tavern and Good. take the Book of Talmoon probably with you. Sneaky escape. Suddenly... A man bursts into the tavern. He is very bedraggled. He is relatively old. Yes. Yeah. Uh, he and he uh, orders an orangina rouge. That's an orangina rouge. It's blood orange orangina. Have you never had it? No. It is the best is drink. It? Oh, oh Matt, we're off topic. <laughs> um, yeah. He slams his fist down on the bar. Ah. He's not a pirate. <laughs> hang on. Hang on. Um, ooh, <laughs> ooh, <laughs> get, get me some of them oranges. <laughs> no, no, fuck that. He slams his fist down the bar. Ah, I'm fucking up. Ooh, I'm looking for someone to come on an adventure. Yeah, he turns to you. Hello. You. Hello. Hello, elf woman. <laughs> You chose a character that makes the rest of this story quite difficult. <laughs> Before we go any further, I am a magic man <gasps> who can change your, your your original choice <laughs> of character to one of these that potentially fits in with the rest <laughs> of the story. I like how the book gives me these opportunities. <laughs> I suggest you stay as a street magician, as Excellent. the comical element of that could go quite far. <laughs> this is great, it's very meta. But being a low self esteemed elf lady has not helped the story. <laughs> Why okay. don't you choose this one? A goblin! No, no, the one next to it. Um, um, a terrapin. Stop making them up. <laughs> oh, what's that you say? A human for ease? A human? Oh, All right, human. fine, a dwarf. Yeah, I'll be a dwarf. <laughs> a dwarf? A crantanker. Oh, that's dwarf. lucky, because the rest of the dialogue is based on dwarfs. <laughs> I'm looking for a very particular dwarf to come on an adventure. And my axe! And you're fine. <laughs> and your and your acts are very particular. You best start believing in adventures, because uh, there's, there's gonna be one. <laughs> oh, I'll get, I'll get my magic kit and join you in the adventure place. The adventure. Why don't you come take a ride on the adventure train? There's an adventure train. That is parked in the train station that I forgot to mention earlier in the story. Okay, so what are my options? Uh, you can either accept his quest. Okay. Or not accept it. I accept! Go, Daddy. Lucky you fucking did. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, this... I just sat in a pub for the rest of the book. Otherwise, this would have been very That'd be boring. great. This gets very slammed. boring from now on.